Now, second thing your daddy should have taught you, your father should have taught you. You cannot control women. If she want to go, she going to go. A hoe is going to be a hoe, period. If she want to do something, there is nothing that you can do to stop it. Learned that from JT Money, 1997, 98 or something like that. But you can't control no woman, fellas. Don't even try it. Don't even try it. If she want to go, meaning if she went, when, when we say she going to go or she don't go or she want to go, that means if she going to have, if she going to want to have her fun or have sex or screw around, that's what she going to do. I don't care what you do to try to stop it. You see what I'm saying? A hoe going to be a hoe. You can't change that. You can't turn a hoe into a housewife. What you guys don't understand is when you guys are controlling, being controlling, and when you when you want to contr- being controlling in that way, that's it's it's a lack of confidence in your ability to keep a woman around. So you have to you have to control them. You have to feel like you have to control their movements and control their body and, and, and confine them because you're scared that you don't have the ability to keep them around, right? Through you know, a lot of guys take the girls' passwords and uh, tell them they can't have an Instagram or they can't go do this or they can't dress like this. What you don't understand about human nature is humans are rebellious by nature. We don't want to be controlled, right? The best way to control a person is to control their mind. If you're going to control your woman, get her mind. This is how you control a woman. You control her mind. But when people feel controlled, they're going to naturally rebel against that. Naturally, right? Prime example. Prime example. There's this whole bug going around, right, for the last couple years. And Americans are willing to tear this country down behind putting on a damn mask. People telling you to put on a mask. They ready, they will burn this mf down. And it's not about being sick because it's, the shit clearly kills, right? I'm not saying it's going to kill everybody, but it's, it's, it's clearly real, right? It's clearly real. Y'all done had it a few times. Shit ain't no joke, right? Uh, And I know people that ain't here behind it, like personally. Um, Clearly real, right? But the fact that you telling them and you forcing them to do it is the problem. See what I'm saying? That's what it is. We we damn near divided more than ever behind these people say you you shouldn't do it or or you need to wear it. And these people are like, nah, you can't tell me what to do. It ain't about safety or none of that. Their thing is you can't tell me what to do. And this is humans in general. But this is what I say about controlling the mind. Now, you have people who willing to burn this motherfucker, this this thing down, right? They willing to burn this thing down over you telling them what to wear on their face, right? But they pay taxes every year. Uh, Follow every, there's more laws in this country than I don't know in, in any other country. They, they follow the speed limit. They don't drink and drive. Uh, you know, they pay the car registration, pay insurance, which is a uh, car insurance, which is a scam and all of this. License and registration fees. They pay housing, uh, uh, HOA fees and following all of these laws, right? If you ask Americans, if you ask, if you take a toll over the, if you take a toll over the, the, the entire planet, right? Of all the nations and you poll all the people, and you ask them who are the freest people, it would be Americans who would say that they are the freest. But we have more prisons, we have more law enforcement, we have more, but we are controlled, and I don't want to get tenfold hat, but we are controlled here. We think we're free. So we follow all of the rules, we follow all of the laws, right? But if you tell the person, you better put a mask on or you're gonna get a fine, or you better do this, or it's They'll tear this motherfucker, they'll tear this thing down. You see? Now, I said that to say, that don't stop with women. You see? Now, they will comply, but when you try to control them, right? When you try to control people and they need you, they'll comply at first. Right? All, all people will comply at first when they feel like they need you or that they don't have an out or a win right there. This is a no-win situation. They'll comply at first. At first, everybody was wearing the, the, the damn mask. But then people got to, it's like, hell nah, bro. You see people on the plane. They got to land the plane because it's a, it's, a, it's a dude on there going crazy. And he don't want to put no mask on. You feel me? 
You feel me? But this dude probably pay all his taxes. All this, see, they got him in his mind. But when you try to force it, nah, land the plane right now. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? F the whole 400 other people on the plane. We got to land this right now. I, I, I tear this thing down. But I said that to say people will comply when they need you or when they don't have a way out. But eventually they're going to buck, right? And what you have to understand about is when you don't let women, if you if, if you don't control her mind, you try to control the physical, she's going to start to resent you after a while, right? And after a while, once she, start to, once she starts to resent you, this is going to grow and it's going to grow, and then she's going to start to chip at you. And once you start buckling, she's going to start rebelling. You see what I'm saying? For trying to change them. And this is going to ultimately end your relationship. People want to be free, right? People want to be free. So you may say, you know, you can't wear this or you got to delete this or, you know, give me your passwords and all of that. They'll comply in the beginning. They always comply in the beginning. But eventually, it ain't going to go good for you. So stop trying to control her. Stop trying to tell her what to wear. Stop trying to t- 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 stop trying to uh, uh, check the phones and all of that. You can't control a woman. What you... W- 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 you can't control a woman. She is going to do what she want to do. You feel what I'm saying? When you control it like that, it only makes you feel better in the moment. Right? But it doesn't fix the issue. You have to fix the issue of why you feel that you have to be like this. You see what I'm saying? Why do you feel like, why do you feel like, you know, you have to control where she go or how much she go or, or, you know, get her phone or go through her phone? Why do you feel like that? So you have to fix that. If it's you, fix you. If she's moving in a way that's, that's suspicious, then you need to get rid of a woman because you shouldn't be with a woman who's doing things to to violate you in a way that makes you feel like that. You feel what I'm saying? So it's either A or B. But it either either or, the, 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 the onus is on you. You feel me? But it's only going to make you feel better in the moment. But what's going to happen is, it's like with, with, with anxiety, right? Or OCD and stuff like this. The things you do to calm the anxiety typically make it worse in the long run because you train your brain you train your brain. What happens is, so let's say, let's just say somebody with OCD, right? Let's say, and, and, and try to try to use this to what I'm talking about. Let's say somebody with OCD, they have to wash their hands for five minutes before they leave, right? Or they feel like they just can't function, right? So they'll wash their hands for five minutes. But well, every time that they give into this, their brain, t- it, it reinforces to their brain that this is what they need in order to feel good, Right? But the more reinforcement, the stronger, the stronger the anxiety when you don't have it. So the more you check your girl's phone, the more you can try to control her and she complies, it feels it's, 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 I don't want to say it feels good, but it'll make you feel better then. But all you're doing is reinforcing to yourself that this is what you need to feel comfortable. And so you do it more, which makes the anxiety more, which makes the anxi- the insecurity even worse. See what I'm saying? This is psychology stuff, right? Um, so it's only going to control you. It's only going to make you feel better in the moment. But it, it, again, like I say, you ain't gonna, you're not going to stop no woman from doing what she want to do. She's going to want to, she going to do what she want to do. It only takes two minutes for a woman to get banged, right? And, and what you don't realize is this control and this tyranny is going to push her away anyway because all it's going to take is the guy that I could, it's, it's going to take, so I was about to go off, right? I'm just about to get excited. But it's going to take, all it's going to take is the guy to position himself as the a freedom fighter, right? I can, You can be free with me. No judgment zone over here, right? I could look in a woman's eyes. This is how much of a seducer I am, right? And I'm not saying everybody's like this, but there are guys out here like this. I could look at a woman and tell if a man is controlling or not. And if I was a dirtbag like I used to do, like I used to be, I can position myself in a way to save her from that. And she'll give me everything I want. Done it before, several times. You see what I'm saying? So just understand that this is what you're up against when, 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 when you try to control your woman. This is why I teach you the game. Get her in the mind and she'll control her goddamn self. You see what I'm saying? Get her mind. She get her mind, everything else falls into place, right? Look at the movie Casino. Uh, 
Sam Rothstein had all the money in the world, you know, and he got with a, a, a HO. And at the end of the day, regardless of the lifestyle he tried to provide her, right? She still, at the end of the day, wanted to be the HO that she was. She still did what she wanted to do at the end of the day. And he ruined his life behind trying to stop her and change her. You see what I'm saying? So that's number two. The second thing your daddy should have told you, your father should have told you, is you can't control women. You can't. You can get their mind, though, and they'll control themselves. Control the mind, but you can't control, you can't be a tyrant with women because they're going to do what they're going to want to do. 